Well, like I said, the credit goes to the offensive line. And uh, they did a good job with stamina blocks. And uh, I did my job uh, for us pressing the line of scrimmage. And then when I seen the opening, and I just hit it, and I uh, just kept running. I, and I have a habit of looking back. And this time, I told myself I'm not looking back. I'm just running. And uh, seeing the defender, uh, after I had broke, uh, gave him a move. And what our coach to do uh, in practice. And uh, most of the time, when you do everything in practice, it leads over to the game. And uh, that's what happened. What about, though, I mean, you're facing the, the league's best pass rush. Consider the fact that they've had 43 sacks already coming into this game. You know, they're, they're pretty tough against the run as well. So, I mean, how much of a challenge did that, you know, did you look at this as? Well, that was one of the challenges going into this game for us. And uh, we met that we met that goal. And uh, it was, all the credit goes to the offensive line. Uh, you guys up front uh, doing a great job of pass protecting. And uh, the backs, we, we did also did a good job uh, not letting the, uh, our guys get to the quarterback. And that goes back to everybody doing that job, and uh, that's what they did. C.J. Spiller, Fred Jackson, those are two of the bigger names in yes. the NFL. Yeah. For you personally, what was it like for you to go out there and have the performance that you did, knowing that those two guys, you know, they might be watching a little bit on the sideline and being able to kind of stack your game up against theirs just a little bit? Well, going into the game, you, you think about those things. But when I'm actually out on the field, I don't think about anything. I don't think about none of that. I think about doing my job and doing what I'm supposed to do to help this team win. Now, after the game, then you realize like who you up against or whatever, and then watching the game on the sideline. But yeah, I talked to him after the game or whatever, and I told him he's a, he's a heck of a player, period. And now I asked him to let me borrow some of his speed. So yeah, he, uh, the CJ was it? Yeah, see, that's what I asked him to let me borrow some of his speed. But yeah, we joked about that. But yeah, he's he's a great player though. And Jackson, well, Jackson, Jackson, he always gonna make plays. And um, I, I guess that the, because you scored within 18 seconds, that's actually the fastest touchdown that's scored by a Buck in team history. Didn't know if you knew that. And apparently, nah. it's also the longest run in team history nah. as well. I knew one of them. I didn't know the other one. But yeah, well, it's always great to go out in history, though. It always, it, that's always great, and it's a blessing to do that, to be able to do that. Yeah, I mean, you know, did you ever think that you'd be in this position right now doing this? Just a few not weeks ago. Us, not for us going out in history or whatever, that play, anything like that, no. But for us planning the league, being that, knowing I can play in the league, yes, I expect to do that. But for us, like, going to history and all that, no, I, not right now anyway, planning on doing that. But it happened, and you know, all the praise goes to God.